Amazon, 18 marketplaces, 300 million customers, 350 million products in the US alone, closer to a billion globally. But the one thing you might not know is that 55% of all sales come from third party sellers. That's people like you and me. So it might be worth answering the question, what is the best selling product on Amazon in the world? By the end of this video, you will know the 17 best selling products on Amazon in the world the number one best selling product in the world, the number one highest revenue generating product on Amazon, the most universally bought product on Amazon, that's between different markets, the top seven categories housing the best selling products, and the average selling price of the best selling products on Amazon. So let's begin our journey. We need to start out by finding the Amazon marketplaces which do the most sales annually. And the top four are the US at 263 billion sales a year, Germany 30 billion, UK 26.5 billion and Japan at 20.5 billion. Next, we actually need to look at the items which sell the most on those marketplaces. Before we can do that though, we need to determine the categories which make the most sales on Amazon. Now, based on research, it's well accepted that these are the top selling categories. Electronics, clothing, shoes and jewelry, home and kitchen, beauty and personal care, toys and games, pet supplies. And with that in tow, we can now begin our search. And one of the key tools here is the Amazon best seller list for each of these markets, which I'm also going to link below for you. Now, one thing to note as we do this, we're just not going to include Amazon specific items, things like Alexa. But here's what we found, starting with the smallest and moving to the biggest market, Japan. Here are the top selling items in the top selling categories, electronics, this was the Anchor Nano at 35,000 sales a month. In the clothing category, we have a t-shirt just under 32,000. Home and kitchen, water purification cartridges at just over 38,000. Personal care, we actually have a washing powder at 132,000 sales a month. Toys and games, we have a model car just under 8,000. Pet supplies, we have cat litter at just under 20,000 sales a month. Our second biggest market, the UK. Electronics, Duracell batteries, 23,000 sales a month. Clothing, we have leggings, just over 1,000. Home and kitchen, again, water filter cartridges here at 21.5 thousand sales a month. Personal care, protein bars, just under 20,000. Toys and games, this push pop-up fidget toy. This is like the new fidget spinner, just over 20,000. Pet supplies, whiskers, food pouches, just over 11,000. Our second biggest market, Germany. Electronics, batteries, almost 45,000 sales. Clothing, another t-shirt, just over 21,000. Home and kitchen, blackout blinds, just over 12,000. Personal care, whey protein, 25,000. Toys and games, a certain card game, over 16,000. Pet supplies, cat litter, over 8,000. And our biggest market, the US. Electronics, binoculars, over 20,000 sales a month. Clothing, women's shorts, at 72,800 sales a month. Home and kitchen, a mattress protector, 53,000 sales a month. Beauty and personal care, a spot treatment, at 84,800 sales a month. Toys and games, an inflatable pool float, 32,000 sales. Pet supplies, earth rated dog sh bags, monthly sales at 85,300 sales a month. So the interesting thing here is that we actually don't see much correlation. I think the most correlation was likely the water purification cartridges and then also the cat litter. And so now what we need to do is look at the specific product types and which of those sells well globally, which of those also makes a lot of sales on other marketplaces. Now I've also added some other products from my 
own research. But this is not totally comprehensive. But these are the top 17 best selling items I could find on Amazon globally. Now for each of these, we're going to bring up the product name price each market's sales. We can use our top market sales for this one item. So it sells in the US, the UK, Germany, Japan, sales numbers and a total sales figure. In 17th place, the Everbright LED flashlight with a total global sales of 8,800 a month. 16th, a card game called What Do You Meme? Lacking sales in some markets, but with a total of 8,900 sales a month. In 15th, these very cool black magic hangers. These are space saving hangers and they have 11,000 sales a month. In 14th, something you might be familiar with, exploding kittens. And these have a total global sales of 14,300 a month. In 13th, pet grooming gloves. And these have a total sales of 17,900 a month. In 12th, a car smartphone holder. These have 22,500 sales a month. In 11th, we have our push pop-up fidget toy at 28,000 sales a month. In 10th, we have the gear light flashlight doing almost 34,000 sales a month. In 9th, we have the Fujifilm mini instant film twin pack 36,300 a month. In 8th, we have the Dash mini waffle maker at just over 38,000 sales a month. In 7th, we have the Vata Pro battery. This sells over 45,000 sales a month. In 6th, we actually have Crocs and these sell 71,000 500 times per month. In fifth, we have the woman's shorts at over 75,000 sales a month. In fourth, we have the water purification cartridges. These sell over 78,000 sales per month. In third, we have the Wisecam V3 selling just under 80,000 sales a month. In second, we have the acne patch spot treatment selling almost 86,000 sales per month. And in first, we have the earth rated dog shit bags at 113,000 sales per month. So based on one exact product type and seeing it sell across markets, the race for the most universally bought product, that is that it's not only bought in one market, but across all of them is between number one, the Crocs and number two, the earth rated dog shit bags. So let's see what happens when we actually add the remaining top markets and the sales those products make for those to this list. For the earth rated bags, when we add Italy, Spain, France, Canada, and Mexico, we get to a total of 115,500 sales per month. And for the Crocs, adding those same markets, we get to a total of 72,900 sales per month. And the results. The most purchased product on Amazon in the world per month are the earth rated dog bags with 115,520 sales per month. A large majority of those coming from the US and UK markets, but Canada and Germany also significantly contributing. The most universally purchased product between all Amazon markets are the Crocs at 72,986 sales per month. The highest revenue generating product on Amazon globally are also the Crocs at $3,140,000 per month. And five notable mentions that got onto this list simply because of their US sales. The spot treatment product, which does almost 85,000 sales a month in the US alone. The Wisecam V3, doing almost 80,000 sales a month in the US alone. The woman's shorts at 75,000, the mini waffle maker at 38,000, and the gear light flashlight at 33,000. Remember, those are sales in the US alone. So these products show us that the best selling items on Amazon sit in the following seven categories. Pet supplies, clothing, shoes, and jewelry, beauty and personal care, electronics, home and kitchen, toys and games, and tools and home improvement. The average price of the 17 best-selling items on our list is $18.76. The average price of the top six, $22.84. Now the Wisecam V3 selling almost 80,000 times a month and selling at $29.98, so almost $30 
as well as the Crocs with 73,000 sales a month and selling at about $43 show us that it's not only low priced, low sell price offers that sell well on Amazon. And also various items made this list just from their US sales alone. Again, proving to us the dominance of that marketplace. Now, if you found this interesting and helpful, perhaps in your own product research, please smash that like button for me. If you yourself do want to become a third party seller and learn more about this, make sure you subscribe to the channel and check out the videos in the end screen about to come up where you can learn a lot more. And this was a broader video. So let me know in the comments below what you thought of it. If you have any recommendations of similar videos and please share this with someone who you think will find it interesting. Again, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.